Mando, come. Come here. I know. Hi. So today we're going to be talking about posting ears. Um, someone had asked me about their Frenchies. They don't, their ears aren't standing. Um, the first thing I always say is try cottage cheese or yogurt to get the calcium intake up. But if that doesn't work, there are two different methods you can use. Um, for the Doberman, we use the duct tape method. So you'll need duct tape, zip ties, but for the sake of the video, I don't have the zip ties that we used before because he's older now, so he doesn't need them. You wanna get the big, huge, thick ones. Like they're super thick. What, what are they like? Air conditioning or something? I don't know, but you can find them at Home Depot. Um, they're really, really thick and they're hard. They don't bend. Super important. Then you need skin tack, adhesive remover, um, medical tape, cotton balls. Oh, here they are. Here's a couple of them. See, they're they're really thick. They don't. They're not as flimsy as this. See, it doesn't it doesn't bend. Whereas this is like you. Um. So basically, what you do, I cut the tip off here. Mando, come here, come, come here, come here. Oof. So you wanna, if you're doing it this way, you wanna go all the way into the bell of the ear. Um, you measure it up to the tip and then cut it off right there. Right, Bubba? Hi. <sighs> I cut the, um, this one's already cut in half, but you cut the, um, the, the cotton ball in half, wrap the bottom of it, of the thing, the zip tie. You don't want the, um, the zip tie to cut the, the dog's ear. So, or, you know, irritate the bell of the ear. So then we just take some medical tape, the soft stuff, the cotton stuff. Wrap it around where the cotton ball sits. Then you're gonna lay out your duct tape, right? Like this, you want the sticky side out. And you're, do, you're gonna do that again. So you're gonna lay another sticky side out. Oh, shoot, sorry, I did it wrong. Keep the cotton ball part out. It's been a while. I just messed up this duct tape too. Oops. So the cotton ball sticks out like that. Then you lay another piece on top and you wanna make sure that there's no air in between the layers of the duct tape so it doesn't separate. Now on these corners here, cut the edges, the corners off. Because you don't want it to agitate the ear you go in. It's gonna look like this. Next, your skin glue. Be generous, right? Yes, Ahsoka, I hear you. She's gonna be really mad at me when she learns it's not her time to come out. <laughs> I'm gonna let it like sit and get tacky for like 30 seconds. But since you put a lot on it, it might take a little bit longer. Oh. 
After you put it in the ear, you're gonna cut around the dog, the shape of the dog's ear. What I suggest is putting some of the um, adhesive remover on a cotton ball to keep your scissors clean or else they'll get stuck on the, 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 um, the tape and it won't be a clean cut. It's best to do this when the dog is tired so they don't move as much. He's probably gonna fight me because we haven't done it in a while. You can clean your fingers off too. It's kind of a pain in the butt. Don't let it sit on wood. It will destroy your wood. Mando, come. Come here. Come here. Down. Come here. I know. I know, Bubba. Be a good, be a good example, please. I know. So this isn't quite ready yet, but whatever, it's just a video. So stick it in. They're not gonna like it at all. Make sure it's in the bell of the ear. Don't get it caught on the, there's like a little ledge in there. Don't get it caught on there, right? I know, I know, I know. It's still wet, I know. This is for a video. We'll let it fall off. I know, Bubba. I know, I know, you hate it, I know. You wanna make sure that the, the post, the, um, the zip tie goes straight down the middle of the ear so it supports that cartilage. No, no moving, please. And then you just trim around the ear. Seems terrifying. If the dog's used to it, it's not so bad. You can leave a little excess trim. If it doesn't stick to the ear, shave the dog's ear. You use electric razor, it's not too bad. And now, now he's mad at me. <laughs> but that's about what it should look like. This is a really crappy post, but it works. He's mad. He's so mad at me. <laughs> okay. Since it didn't stick, that's perfect anyways. All right, go on. Go be mad. The other, it also didn't work because it is so flimsy. Um, the other method that we have, same thing, moleskin, right? Measure the dog's ear, how long it is. The stuff you can get at like CVS, um, Walgreens, whatever, Amazon, I got my own Amazon. Measure the dog's ear. Let's say for a Frenchie, I don't know. It's a baby. This one you don't really have to um, shape to the ear. Just make sure that you cut the ends again like that. So it's like that. You can use this or um, if, if you do use the um, the zip ties, cut it so it's not all the way at the end of the moleskin because the moleskin will protect it. But if you do it like that, you know, just put it in the middle of the moleskin, you'll duct tape it, or you can use um, a nasal strip. So once you have the nasal strip or the duct tape or the, um, the zip tie with the duct tape on, there's an adhesive back. Peel that off, put some um, skin glue on, and then just stick it in there. Again, same method, same way. Your puppy should only need it max couple weeks. Hopefully, combine that with um, cottage cheese, yogurt, anything with calcium, it'll help the cartilage um, stiffen up. And then your puppy's ear should stand. Super easy. I, in the past, have cut around, like, so I've traced the puppy's ears when they're sleepy. So um, I can, you know, do the whole ear, but I don't think that's really necessary. You just need something that's like super stiff, either the, the industrial zip ties or the um, nasal strip. So that's all you do.
It's really easy. Oh, um, clean or change them twice a day because the dirt and the grime builds up, the, the skin glue built, builds up. You don't wanna get like a yeast infection or anything like that. Um, so just make sure you change it twice a day. And, and most of the time they're running around and playing anyways, so it pops off. Um, no, yeah, no. So yeah, just that's all, that's it.